My four kids can't believe how I ever functioned in the period BC, before computers, before email, before mobiles and cell phones, before Facebook and Twitter and all those other things that they spend their lives on on their iPad. How did you ever organise a social life, Mum? They asked me. You know, I tell them we used to send smoke signals. The fact is the world's changed a lot in the last 10, 20 years. It's going to change just as much, if not more, in the next decade or two. You have to be constantly looking out for what is it that you need to be embracing in your environment. How do you need to be adapting to all the changes going on around you in order to be successful? You know, it wasn't that long ago that people thought it was impossible to get a man on the moon. And yet, look today, we're heading towards having people heading out towards Mars. There's so many changes going on in the world and being able to succeed in this ever-changing, increasingly competitive and uncertain world means embracing change, it means being proactive, it means being flexible, and it certainly means challenging the assumptions that you have about yourself and what is possible for you. Change before you have to. Change is never easy, even change for the better. And I think as human beings, we're wired to avoid change, to resist change. But if you want to be more successful in the future than you have in the past, ask yourself, how is it that I'm looking at my current situation that is really holding me back? What are things going on around me? What are changes taking place that I'm not embracing? And where are there opportunities in those changes that I need to seize? Good luck. And remember that whatever changes that you have coming your way, you have the ability not only to handle them, but to actually benefit from them.